Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella, and today I'm going to show you... <laughs> I completely forgot what I was going to say. I always do that. Anyways, today I'm going to show you the box I got from Hershner's. It's right here. That was it's gift it gifted to me by Hershner's, but technically it was gifted from viewers of me and Jennifer at Cinnamon Stitches. They sent Jen Jennifer um, a box with uh, four craft projects in it, uh, crochet ones and stuff. And they wanted her to pick out a few people to send more boxes to. <clears throat> and then she had her viewers uh, say in the comments like who she gets these boxes. And then um, drama stemmed from that and then blah, 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 blah. Point is she picked me as one of them. <laughs> and a lot of people uh, commented on there. And I appreciate that. I read all the comments and it was really nice. But I finally got my box. <laughs> I was wondering when it was coming because I kept seeing other people get theirs. And I was like, oh, where's mine now? But I finally got it um, yesterday. And so I'm filming it now. I already opened it, of course. <laughs> but uh, I do want to thank everybody who nominated me for uh, one of her boxes and her herself, <laughs> Jennifer, for um, picking me. But anyways, I had a piece of wrapping paper over the top of it. And then it has the note um, that you've probably seen, but the, the, the little event is called, um, Gnome for the Holidays is like the, the name, and then the hashtag is rolling with my gnomies, which, uh, Jennifer actually did a little thing off of Clueless, rolling with my homies, but, um, she said gnomies, cause, you know, it's the gnomies, and I thought it was so funny, <laughs> I love that movie, but, um, the letter, I'm just gonna read it real quick, it says, uh, hello Ella Roberts, <laughs> You have a friend that thinks you're pretty great. They have chosen you to play a game with Hershners and our gnomes. The Hershner gnomes have created a game called Hanging With My Gnomies, 12 Days of Christmas Crafts. And they're hoping you'll play along. We have sent 12 people the first four Christmas crafts for this year's 12 Days of Christmas. Uh, and one of those people have chosen you to receive four more of those sneak pre preview items before everyone gets uh, to see them on December 1st. You can enjoy opening, creating with, and sharing if you choose. Each of these crafts will give you um, a hint. How did I read that? Each of these crafts will give you a hint about four of our crafts for the season. If you choose to share, I use these hashtags, blah, blah, blah. And they also gave me a code for a free one time uh, use of free shipping from Hushners, which is cool. I've never ordered anything from there, but that's not anything against them. It's just I never order anything online hardly ever anyways. <laughs> I'm just a shopping person kind of person. But anyway, so my four crafts I'm pretty excited about. There are um, three of them are things I've been wanting to try and then just the extra one. <laughs> so the first one, I'll just grab it out here, is called Merry Fun Mini Embroidery Hoop Ornaments. So it's little uh, embroidery projects. And it has this stuff in there. And the Ada cloth, I think, is what it's called. <laughs> is in between these pieces of paper. It's in there. But it comes with all the supplies to make, I guess, all four of these. I'm assuming. It's a set of four. So, I'm sure it does. But that's really cool. I've always wanted to try embroidery, although I don't think I'm going to be good at it. <laughs> so, we'll see. I guess. Okay, the next one is oh, another thing I've been wanting to try forever. And it's macrame. And uh, it's snowflake macrame ornaments. There's what they look like. And it comes with the cords and some kind of little plastic things. I have no idea what that is because I've never done macrame. And the instructions are in there. <laughs> I've never done macrame, but I've seen it and it's really cool. So I'm looking forward to trying that too. This is actually cool because I like to hand make ornaments every year for my family. I normally crochet them. This year I was going to sew them, but I just haven't had the time so far. But this is an ornament, uh, felt Christmas gnomes ornaments. And it has a set of six. So I can make six of these little gnomes. And it's got felt and the thread. And the, the yarn is back there that they make the beard with. And there's some sequins and uh, it looks like beads down in there. And right here it looks like some elastic maybe. And that's probably what's around their little hats. The little borders of their hats. Oh, that's pretty cool. I think there's bells in there. I can hear something jingling. <laughs> but I might make these for my family uh, this year. 
And then the last thing is another thing I've been wanting to try forever. And it is plastic canvas. And this one makes a reindeer gift bag. And it is um, 10, 10 by 13 by 4. So there's the reindeer. And there's all the yarn that you use to make it. I have no idea how you do this either. <laughs> I've seen people do it before, but I've never tried it. And I've always wanted to try a plastic canvas. I see little kits like this all the time at my thrift store. Um, they usually are missing the yarn. They just have like the canvas and the pattern. But um, it's cool. I've been wanting to try three of these things. You know, I've made stuff with felt before, <laughs> but I'm still excited about getting that because uh, I can make ornaments. But I've been wanting to try these three things for like ever. <laughs> so I'm super excited about getting to do it. Um, I'm really excited about this gift bag. I'm probably not going to gift it to no one though. I'm probably going to make it and keep it and use it as decoration because it's cute. <laughs> and uh, it's probably going to be a lot of work because uh, it'll be the first thing like this I ever do. So uh, it'll probably take a while. <laughs> and macrame has always been cool because it's basically knots, isn't it? It's like knot making. And uh, yeah, I've seen like macrame planters that you like hang and put a pot in and there's a lot of macrame um wall hangings like a hobby lobby they sell them they almost look crocheted but you do it with your fingers and um it's just cool so i'm looking forward to it the macrame cotton is willow brand i can see it through the wrapper willow yarns i've had some willow yarns before so that's neat i'm looking forward to trying all these i'm excited i'm all worried about this though i don't think i'm gonna be able to do this good because i don't think there's a pattern I think it's just like a piece of cloth and you gotta go with it. Maybe there is a pattern. Let me look. Ah, yes, there is. <laughs> There's little faint um, patterns that you, I guess you trace over kind of with the, the, the thread, the floss. Okay, I'm a little bit more confident now. <laughs> If it was just me doing it on my own, it would have looked horrible. It would have been abstract because it would have it would have not looked like the picture. <laughs> but I'm excited. These would be cute ornaments too. Because you could just, you know, put something on there to make it an ornament. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm so excited. <laughs> I love that this is all new stuff. Like I would have been equally happy with a crochet kit or knitting kits. But uh, I'm even more excited because it's new things. You know, stuff I've never really done before. I used I've cross stitched before, but it's been forever. And, um, you know, I've made crafty type things, but this is a whole new one. You know, I've never made a gnome. And it sounds like there's a lot of stuff in there. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah, there are little bells. I can see them. Eee, I'm so excited. <laughs> Anyways, I'll definitely share these when I, as I make them. I'll probably make some of them soon. Like if I make these as a gift to my family, I like to give it to them usually around Thanksgiving. Um, let's see here. Sister, brother. Uh, a mom, me, and then I'll leave two extra ones that I can give to other people. And um, yeah, Woo, I'm excited. And plus, I'll have the t the uh, the information about how to make more in the future. If I wanted to make more uh, little gnomes in the future, I can do that. I'm so excited! Yay. So thank you so much, everyone who nominated me, and for Jennifer for um, sent, you know letting me be p picked. However, she decided to do that. And also, thank you, Hershners, for uh, sending it to me for free. That's so cool. And, um, it's neat. I can't wait to see what everyone makes who got, who got, gets it. I already seen Jennifer's stuff. She made the little fish, um, washcloths. What else did she make? I forgot. <laughs> but I remember the fish. Because I thought the fish was super cute. But, uh, yeah, I'm super excited. I'm going to definitely, um, as I make these crafts, I will share them with you guys on videos and maybe on Instagram if I can remember. And, uh, maybe you can check them out and see if there's anything you'd like to purchase on Hershner's website. I'll link it below. And uh, yeah, I guess that's it for now. I'm going to go ahead and hop off here and I'll see you guys next video. Bye guys.